June and I sold our herd to Warren and Michelle in 2002 mm -hmm. and just retained our homestead in two acres. Mm -hmm. And in 2003, Warren offered a heifer at, at the CMEX sale in uh, Cambridge Lodge at the time mm -hmm. of the field days. Mm -hmm. And I sent the pedigree to the Queen and the mm -hmm. Queen suggested we buy the heifer in partnership. So we bought the heifer, I went to the sale and it registered as an international syndicate. No one knew who bought, so I rang the Queen next morning and we got the heifer for 4000 And she'd won at least to show us a calf that year, in, in uh, 2004. And so I rang the Queen next morning and she said, I'll oh, tell Warren Michelle to send the bill half for me and I'll pay half from, to Buckingham Palace. And these are her first two calves. And how do you call the Queen? You talk to her on the phone, it's Her Majesty first, and then when you're talking to her, chatting away, it's ma'am. Yes. And why is she interested in these? Things? Well, since 1975, she had been buying cattle from us in New Zealand to go to her rural herd, Windsor, and we'd been going there since 77. And our cattle did very well for her over the years. And uh, it's just a hobby that her and I've got. And what we hope to do with these is send embryos over to England to carry on this family at Windsor. And uh, when the mother carved as a two-year-old in 2005 and this one was born, I rang the Queen and I said, the heifer's made a beautiful vessel and we've got a lovely heifer calf. I'll show them at the Royal in Hamilton in 2005. And the Queen, I said to the Queen, I'll just show them under my name. She said, no, you won't. We're partnership. We'll show them under Her Majesty the Queen and D.T. Ferguson. And that's how we show them. You do what the Queen tells you to do. I went to South Africa and flew to England and selected the team in February of 92 and flew home. And I was only going for six weeks, but then the herdsman was dismissed for abusing the staff, not through the Queen, by the hierarchy between them. So I ended up managing the herd for four months at Windsor and preparing all the cows and... Uh, the Duke come down and told, said to me, well, where are you going to live while you manage? I said, in a caravan that's there. He said, no, you won't. You'll live at Frogmore House before you live in a caravan. So we live in the flat at Windsor Castle. So, uh, and the last, when we, she farewelled us after four months working there and preparing the cows, she said, now, for goodness sake, keep in touch. Mm -hmm. I won the Derby and Oaks champion at Melbourne at the World Conference Show with a cow I bred here for the Queen. I came back in Ox and won the Centennial Show at Hamilton in 92. So I said to June, I'll ring the page and give the Queen the message because I had no idea of talking to the Queen on the phone. But when I rang, the, I, uh, the page said, oh no, when you ring, I'm going to put you through to ma'am. And from that day on, she's rang us and we ring her. I'll be ringing her Monday morning, how we get on here at the show. She knows we're here at the show now.